Hello friends, welcome to my channel once again. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to easily clear up disk space on your Windows computer using a free tool called WizTree. As you can see, my C drive is almost full and it shows a red bar, which indicates that I'm running out of free space. Having no disk space can cause your computer to run slow. So it is important to free up some space when your drive starts getting full. And doing this manually, I mean browsing through your files and folders to find what is taking up space can take a long time. That is the reason we will be using Vistree because Vistree can scan your drives quickly and will display the files and folders which are taking lots of space. I will leave a link in the description box where you can download and install Vistree. Once installed, just run it and select the drive you want to analyze. It'll take a minute to scan your drive. So let's uh, go to the website. You need to look for WizTree in Google. When you search for WizTree in Google, you get this website. Just click on the first link. And when you go to this page, you simply click on download. And on the next page, there will be two options, download installer, download portable. Installer is something that will be installed in your computer and portable will not get installed, but it will work same way. So without installing, you can use this portable version. I will click on the portable one. And a zip file will be downloaded. So if I just go to our download folder, there will be a zip file. I'll just extract it. You need to just right click on it and click on the fourth option or click on the option that shows the same exact name, extract to the name. And as soon as you click that, it will create another folder, which will have two exe files. So this, the one that says 64, that is for a 64 bit operating system users. And the one that is just wiztree.exe that is for 32 bit operating systems. So mine is 64 bit. So I will click on the second one that is wiztree64.exe. Just click on yes on user account control. And now you can and I will just close this window. So when you open the software, you will get this interface where you will have options to scan drives. Like I have C drive, that is my computer drive. D drive is external. E drive is a flash drive that I have connected to my computer. So you may have lots of drives but c is the one that we are going to analyze because we need space in our system so you can select the drive and click on scan and it will scan your complete c drive and you will get the information about all files and folders with their size. So now you can just click on the plus sign of those folders and you'll come to know what exactly is taking lots of space on your computer. And you can change the view. If you look here, it shows tree view, file view. So if you want, you can change the view. So it will show you uh, the files with their size at the right hand side. So you can check go through the list and decide which file you want to keep and which file you want to delete. So in my case, I don't need this game. I can simply highlight it, right click on it and then click on Explorer folder. When you click on Explore folder, it will take you to the location where that file is saved. And from there, you can delete that file. If that is a part of a program, you can remove that program. So in this case, it is a part of Forza Horizon game. 
and I don't need this game so I can just delete it from here highlight the game folder and either you can uninstall it or you can delete it from your computer so I don't have uh, it installed it was just a folder which was saved so I'll just click on yes to remove it permanently Okay, that is gone. Now, if I go back to this PC, I got 217 GB free out of 930 GB. So, same way, you can just go back to that software and analyze which disk you want to check for the files which are taking uh, lots of space and simply remove those files. It will be easier for you to find uh, the files this way using this software. Now you can uh, just click on scan again and it will analyze uh, your C drive once again. Now there will be a long list of files you can just go back to the folder and you can check now the user folder uh, is occupying 278.6 gb so i'll just expand it and we'll check so there's 32 gb which is in my downloads so you can go to the download folder by right clicking on it and click explore and in your download for uh, in your download folder you can delete files which you have downloaded and installed so their uh, setup file will be there which you can delete and it will clear lots of space on your computer and if you look at the bottom, you get a view that is uh, similar to heat map. But the easiest way to find a file would be just check the folder uh, view first. So you'll get an idea. Then you can switch to file viewer and you can check a particular file. Just simply right click on that file and click on file explore. So it will take you to the location from where you can delete that particular file. So that's all I wanted to show you in this video. I'll just close this. This software is not installed in your computer. You can simply go back to your download folder or wherever you will save this particular folder. It will be located there. If you want, you can just delete this folder and download it again when you need it. Or you can just keep this particular folder in your system. So that way you can use it without installing it. So click the like button if you like the video and subscribe to my channel. You have a great day. Bye-bye.